Foxy in here, dude. My favorite dish. I got you again. Come on, dude. Today, I'm about to learn y'all what to do when you got that dude that says, Oh, I want the jambalaya with all the meat. I don't like that rice. I bet you do like that meat. Jambalaya full of meat. Let's get it, dude. We don't have time to find around, dude. We're cooking for a little local fundraiser. Hit it with that holy. Buku. Y'all pimp. Don't forget that old oink oink, dude. That old pork. That oh, what, what, the pork? That's that garlic, dude. Put that in there. Now we're gonna brown down this first, and then I'm gonna show you where the meat lovers come in. We're gonna season that right from the beginning. Two cans and that old two step, dude. Get it in there. Shake and bake on that thing, dude. Come look right here. We got that browning down. Look, them juices are flowing. This is where the meat lovers come in. I don't want to overcook that chick on them yard pimps. I don't want them falling off the bones. I don't want this full of bones. So you're gonna have to be careful. Don't overcook it. We want it just right. Oh look, I got some chicken thighs too, dude. Phew, get that out of here. Oh, look at Rice. I want nothing but meat. I got your meat dude, right here. Give your whole yard pimp stick. It's about that time for that smoked sausage, dude. Oh. I might not even put rice in here. Yeah, I'm might break a paddle of these. When I see that yard pimp start to separate from the bone, that's when I know it's time to move on to the second step. We don't want it falling apart. You'll see. Buku amount of meat in this thing here, dude. Probably going to feed about 200 feet. We're going to hit that with that yard pimp juice. Made right out of a bucket, dude. Get that out of here. Turn that around. We're gonna let that cook for about 30 minutes. And while we wait, top. Come see, I'm gonna tell you what I'm talking about with them yard pimps. Come look at it. You see where that meat starts pulling from them bones? That's when I know it's time to move on to the next step right here, dude. Got the parsley, cream of onion, cream of celery. I know y'all hate it, but it makes it. Not dry, dude. Get that out of there like that. We want all of that in there. If I didn't tell you I put that in there, you would never know. But hey, I ain't gonna lie to you, dude. I'm gonna give you the secrets on this channel. Come look at that, dude. That's already going. You don't even know what's in there. Look at that. Creamy. Oh, if you like that dry rice, dude, then you don't have to put that in there. I don't want to choke on my jambalaya, dude. A yard pimp update. Check out that. Boom. Just in case y'all think it was falling off the bone. Bringing that to that rolling ball. We're going to hit it with that beautiful 30 pounds of Louisiana white rice. I know when I called y'all couillons out about that football rice, y'all quit showing y'all rice. Y'all started hiding y'all rice. If you don't know your water to rice ratio, just keep using that blue ball rice and cheat. I'm going to show y'all when it's time to cover and put on a little. Come see real quick. There's no rice. The rice is gone. We're about to bring that rice back to the top, dude. Come see that rice now. Come look. See that rice back on the top? Now you see that rice. Cover that. 43 minutes, put your fire on the low as it goes. If your fire goes out, and then 43 minutes, just leave your fire out. But listen, no peak in 43 minutes, a lot of time to wait and hydrate, dude. 
Then 43 minutes, dude. Time to. Wee! Come look at here. Time to fluff. Check this out, dude. On the bone, comes right off. Mmm. So I said, bone. Thank you, cracker sister. I put that jambalaya on a cracker, dude. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Thanks to Spears Hardware, Fernwood, Mississippi, for a great event. We had a great time. Put that on a cracker, dude. It was money. <laughs>